Pero por qué, por qué, pero por qué. Disturbing video shows what appears to be an elderly woman being abused. The alleged abuser, the victim's caretaker. NBC6's Laura Rodriguez is outside that assisted living facility where police are sending a message to the public on ways to avoid these situations. Laura? And this facility off of Southwest 68th Avenue and 78th Terrace. This is in the South Miami area. There was a lot of activity here today. Police were here. The state agency that regulates assisted living facilities also here. The granddaughter of this woman tells us her grandmother has Alzheimer's. And just a warning, this video may be very disturbing to watch and listen to. Georgia! Those are the shrieks of an elderly woman in a bathroom at an assisted living facility. Police say the woman spanking her is Josephine Gurri, caretaker and registered owner of Good Family Home Inc. The 84-year-old woman's granddaughter reported this to police Tuesday after receiving the video from another caretaker who used to work at the ALF. On March 19th, she resigned from her job here because she knew that things weren't legit. Gurri was arrested, but is now out of jail on bond. We knocked on her door, and she did not want to comment. No la necesita. South Miami police say at least two other patients were living at this facility when this happened. Thursday afternoon, it appears family members came to pick up the last remaining resident. NBC6 cameras also captured the Florida Agency for Healthcare Administration walking into the home. They say Gurri surrendered her license. Monitor your, your you know, your, the assisted living facility or the caretaker. Look for any, any signs of abuse, bruising. Uh, some, some patients, they don't want to eat and they, they don't feed them. You know, the losing of the weight. There's several things that, that you, you just got to keep an eye out. And it also may be a good idea to show up at these facilities unannounced. Now, police tell us that they are concerned there may be more victims. So if you believe you may have been a victim of this woman uh, at this assisted living facility, you're asked to call police, South Miami police. Reporting live in South Miami, I'm Laura Rodriguez, NBC6 News.